The Role of a Certified Scrum Product Owner CSPO, Responsibilities and Challenges In a world where adaptability, responsiveness, and delivering value are paramount, the CSPO is at the helm, steering the ship towards project excellence. Understanding the CSPO Role The Certified Scrum Product Owner CSPO, plays a pivotal role in the Scrum Framework, acting as the linchpin between development teams and stakeholders. We delve into the key aspects that define the CSPO's responsibilities. Product Visionary The CSPO is the visionary of the product, tasked with developing a clear understanding of what needs to be built and why. Team Support CSPOs are there to support the development team in understanding the product vision, clarifying requirements, and answering questions, ensuring the team can work efficiently. Effective Backlog Management the product backlog is the beating heart of agile product development, and the certified scrum product owner, CSPO, is its custodian. Backlog management is a vital aspect of the CSPO's role, encompassing the organization, prioritization, and continuous refinement of tasks and requirements. Collaborating with stakeholders. Identifying stakeholders. Cast a wide net. The CSPO's first step is identifying all potential stakeholders. Active listening, paying close attention to the needs and concerns of stakeholders. Managing expectations, transparency, being transparent about what can and cannot be delivered in a given time frame. Balancing priorities. As a certified Scrum product owner, CSPO, one of the most significant challenges is striking the right balance between multiple, often competing, priorities. The CSPO must be a master of prioritization ensuring that the development team is working on the most valuable tasks. The decision-making dilemma. Balancing flexibility and stability. Deciding how much flexibility can be accommodated within the project without compromising stability and predictability. User feedback and prioritization. Incorporating user feedback. Deciding how to prioritize and implement user feedback while maintaining alignment with the project's objectives. Managing expectations. Communicating decisions regarding the implementation of feedback to stakeholders and end-users. User-centric product development. Here are the principles of user-centric product development. User empathy. Putting yourself in the user's shoes. The CSPO must strive to understand the user's perspective, their goals, and the problems they need the product to solve. Prioritizing user stories. Prioritizing user stories based on user value and business objectives. Feedback integration. Feedback loops. Establishing feedback loops that allow for the continuous integration of user feedback into the product development cycle. Here are challenges and strategies for effectively adapting to change. Agile mindset. Adopting an agile mindset that values adaptability and welcomes change as a means of improvement. Balancing scope and schedule. Ensuring that scope changes don't jeopardize project timelines. Managing expectations and feedback. As a certified Scrum product owner, CSPO, your role extends beyond managing the product backlog. You are also responsible for effectively managing stakeholder expectations and feedback, a task that requires finesse and communication skills. Let's explore the intricacies of this responsibility. Clear communication. Open dialogue. Establishing open and transparent lines of communication with stakeholders. Regular updates. Progress reporting, providing stakeholders with regular updates on the project's progress. Overcoming challenges and obstacles. Conflicting priorities. Challenge, balancing the priorities of different stakeholders can be challenging. Strategy, engage stakeholders in discussions to align their priorities with the project's objectives. Use data and clear communication to make informed decisions. Changing requirements. Challenge. Requirements can change frequently, making it challenging to maintain a stable product backlog and plan. Strategy. Embrace change as an opportunity for improvement. Implement change management processes to assess and integrate new requirements effectively. Continuous improvement for CSPOs. Self-assessment. Reflect on your role. Regularly assess your performance and the impact you're making as a CSPO. Certification. Consider advanced certifications or training courses to enhance your skills and knowledge. Feedback processing. Process feedback by identifying actionable areas for improvement and taking steps to address them. Conclusion. 
In conclusion, CSPO training and certification provide individuals with essential knowledge and skills to effectively fulfill the product owner role in Scrum teams. As a result, CSPO certified professionals are well prepared to drive innovation, deliver customer satisfaction, and contribute to the success of their organizations in an agile context.